surrender. The old father demands it. No. <sighs> Good. This fight is mine, boy. Go! <clears throat> and where do you think you're going? Oh no, brother! The little freak's got a bow. What are we gonna do? <laughs> Could you take a look at this? Honestly? I don't have much else going on right now. Oh. The travelers. Oh, disgusting. Mm. Smelly, covered in God knows how many little beasties, but gorgeous armor. Let's see if I can't make something more sanitary. Yes? Poor Fafnir. There's a fine line between ambition and greed, you know. How about you, young one? I suppose you prefer my brother's work? <laughs> You're wrong, of course. So, this plan of yours. Can you guess it? Knowing you, it doesn't involve standing around here. Correct. But how do we move forward? My shop's right here! We heading into that building? Yes. You think there's something inside that'll help us break the ice and get to the chisel tip? No. Hmm. I'll keep thinking.
Let me hear. You knew this place? Before? I came here on a diplomatic mission once, trying to broker a peace between Asgard and Vanaheim. That war. So many lives lost. What I didn't know was Thor had already gone on a killing spree of giants. What did the giants have to do with the war between the gods? Nothing at all, lad. That's the tragedy of it. They took no side in that madness. But Odin's paranoia is surpassed only by Thor's lust for blood. Another crystal. Just give the word.
got most of it. Well, a stealthy plan it is not. Now we must free the other strap. We do? Going up, and what we need is all the way down there. Think. Well, the chisel tip is under thick layers of ice, so melting it won't work. Correct. And there weren't any shattered crystals nearby for me to shoot, so that's not an option. Correct. I just leave smashing the ice. We need something ridiculously heavy to. Oh, I get it now. Good. going to turn the hammer so it lands near the chisel tip. Not possible. We cut it free, write it down, and figure out what comes next after. So your plan involves a whole bunch of luck then? You are welcome to suggest a different one. Tight. Uh, the plan seems ill advised. Jump! That didn't work. It only fell a little ways. Oh no! The floor collapsed. There's a sand bowl, but how do we get to it? We cannot. What does it say? When time itself is disarrayed, the forward path is retrograde. Retrograde? It's backwards? Those symbols. The seasons? Yeah, but the order's all jumped. Shouldn't it be winter, spring, summer, autumn? Why start with winter? It's from a song Mother used to sing. Don't 
I know that one. Winter at Quiet Head. Doesn't like music either. Got it. Boy. House. House. Veteran. Sumar. Yeah. That wasn't right. Right. House. House. Veteran. Sumar. Still nothing. Boy. The order from the song again. Winter, spring, summer, autumn. <laughs> Right. Veteran. Va. Sumo. House. It didn't work, but I know that's the order in the song, Mom said. Do it. Veteran. Va. Sumo. House. It didn't work, but I know that's the order in the song. Try that. Vet. Var. Sumer. House. It didn't work, but I know that's the order in the song. Boy. Vetter. Var. Var. House. Retrograde labs. What? Of course. The riddle. The answer is reversed. <laughs> Try that. Veteran. Sumar. Vower. House. The riddle. Winter is last. Here you go, brother. Winter, spring, summer, autumn. Atreus, that word. Thola. It means endure. Try it. Thola. Well done, lad. Write it again. Thola. The energy's lifting the platform. Keep writing. Thola. Thola. Head. How is this possible? My guess? Temporal magic. Dangerous stuff the High Vanir gods used to play around with. The ability to freeze time. Happened to be a favorite of Njord himself, in fact. Used to? Why did they stop? Well, turns out stopping time keeps the sun and moon from streaking across the sky. Unfortunately, it does not stop the wolves that chase them. Always looking to sink their teeth in. After that, they decided it was best to leave time alone. I can't get to the wall! <laughs> Behind your brother! 
Back to writing, before the floor collapses. Having a little fun, you big grump. Well, there it is. How are we going to get it free? A push. But Trust me. Ready. Dig in and push with everything. Yes, sir. Jump! Really? Come! Do not panic! Why would I panic? Whoa. I have you! Right, you know that. Well, well. well. <sighs> Good. We should keep moving.
chisel tip. Give the man credit. He has a talent for destroying things. Remember that head. Never leaves my mind. Those are the guys we saw with Balder. His nephews? Aye. Magni and Modi. The sons of Thor. Mother always said the Aesir were the worst of gods. And Thor was the worst of the Aesir. I guess he's a terrible father, too. They are no longer children. They have no excuse. Will Sindri be okay? I'll never even see him. Ah, the great dining hall. Envy of all Midgard. Funny. I remember there being a massive candelabrum. It's really livened up the place. There. Oh, yes. You just can't help but break things, can you? Jarl's throne was just on the other side of that wall of ice. Focus up, boy! Oh! 
no way to reach it. See, lad, he's fine. Thought it best to vanish when Thor's idiot sons showed up. Found anything good in Fafnir's storeroom? Like maybe a whetstone? Would you focus on your damn job? You quit that shit. I mean it. We went to war with Uncle and walked away. Maybe. Uncle had three straight years. So you will stop talking, focus, and help me, Valkyrie. Who can't disappoint Father? Oh, smack you, boy. No, no, we cannot disappoint Father. Now keep looking. Uh, yes, yes, come in.
What else was there? Hurry, brother. We may get a piece of the chisel and be gone before they even notice. demands it. No. <sighs> Good. This fight is mine, boy. Go! <clears throat> and where do you think you're going? Oh no, brother. The little freak's got a bow. What are we gonna do? <laughs> <laughs> Don't tell me what to do. <laughs> 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 What does Odin want? Don't know. Don't care. Come here, Harry. You're done now. That is it. Shut up! Don't call me that! Yes! <laughs> 
She cut up your face, so you do it about her. Don't talk about my mother! Don't talk about my mommy! <laughs> Don't listen to him, lad! He's trying to rile you up! Idiot! Ascender Thor are welcome to try! Head! Sorry! Overstepped, yeah? I see that! Come I on, see that! The boy's sick, he needs flair. No! Steady. I'll be all right. There you go, lad. <clears throat> I'm fine, see? We should keep an eye on him. With that, we can carve the travel rune to Jotunheim. Get you where you need to go. Oh, incidentally, all those magically sealed doors we've seen can now be unlocked. Like that one round the corner. You can get through that door there now that you've got the chisel.
You killed Maggie. That he did. She was a god. But you killed him. Minor Aesir, perhaps. But I... And his father is Thor. Not minor. Not minor at all, him. This will not go over well in Asgard. I defended us. Nothing more. I fear no judgment. Judgment? No. But if vengeance is any concern... Since when can you kill a god? <coughs> Found anything good in Fafnir's storeroom, like maybe a whetstone? Try that. Let's get started then.
Be seeing ya! Just make sure you watch each other's backs in the storeroom. Wouldn't want to lose my loyal customers. I don't think the lad's doing too well. I'm fine. Nothing to worry about. If so, then keep up. Yes, sir. Magni didn't come back to life. That is interesting. It's known the Aesir find their own way to Valhalla. No Valkyrie escort, no processing at the gates of Helheim. That may be significant. Giant's hand. What? What is this place? Fishermen would bring the day's catch into this port and use that contraption to send some of it directly to the Jarl's main kitchen. The rest were sorted and sold. There is an exit under the thumb. Find a way across. There's a path to the exit on the other side.
think that did it. Back under his palm. We're almost there. Everything we just did. Climbed around a dead giant. Rode a giant falling hammer. Fought some bad gods. What do you think Mother would say? Bet you have come a long way. Thanks. What now then? Maybe Freya ought to have a look at the boy. No, I feel better now. I just needed to catch my breath. Where do we go next? Well, now that we've got the giant's chisel, we need to learn the travel room to Yacht Knight, so we can... ...carve it into that special gateway atop the peak, and open realm travel to the land of the giants. You don't know it? Alas, no. But the Serpent did mention that the Giants had entrusted that secret for Tyr. Isn't Tyr dead? Aye, but his hidden boat is very much in reach. The doors are beneath his temple, submerged in the lake for generations until our snake friend shifted his weight. There we shall find the fabled Black Rune of Jotunheim. We could also explore some more. We got that chisel now, and that vault isn't going anywhere. Seems a shame to waste the boat. We shall see, boy. Mimir, you were in the middle of a story before. What were you saying about the Long War? Enough was enough. And at last, Odin's most brilliant advisor became determined to find a more enlightened path. He set about to broker a peace between the gods. It took some convincing, but ultimately Odin was persuaded to marry his deadliest enemy, a certain Vanir goddess, legendary not only for her fertile beauty, but her genius at the very Vanir magic that Odin had long aspired to master. Freya married Odin? What was in it for her? It was a sacrifice to protect her people. A selfless act. ...of love. Truly, she deserves better than she got. But of course, there's more to that story.
Did you see something out there? That tower? I see no tower. Maybe I'm seeing things. Tears vault is behind that magical lock. Another one of these. It's Tyr, but the middle panel is missing. Wait, I thought Tyr was a god, not a giant. Ah, but he was loved by everyone, including the giants. Other than me, he was the only one they gifted with their special sight. Hey, I wonder if the giants left a triptych about me somewhere too. Go ahead. Actually, come look. Let me show you how to read this. That is not necessary. You've taught me so much. Let me teach you something. Atreus. Come on. You already speak it. Learning to read won't be that hard. I know how to read, boy. Just not this tongue. You're halfway there already, then. Okay. So the runes represent a lot of different things. Some gods. Some animals. Wait. Some... Oh, am I going too fast? Sorry, Not I'll... that. Do you smell something? Yeah, I do. Smells like... Rain? You ruined everything! I earned that fucking hammer! But now... Everyone's gonna think I only got it, cause Magni's gone! It'll be a joke! But if I kill you, no one's gonna laugh at me! Oh, are you dumb? That your father's doing? Or did you get it from your mum? She's stupid and ugly. That's true, but I'm going to get to know you really well. You're going to be my new brother, right after I finish killing your father! Oops, I think I broke him! <laughs> The boy. Atreus. 
You have to get into Freya quickly. There's no other way. Take the boat. Freya's isn't far. Odin's eye is on you, brother, especially now that you've taken to killing his kin. This forest is a blind spot for him. This is our smartest move. And if anyone can heal him, it's her. What is happening to him? I've seen it in mortals that some conflict of the mind expresses itself as an ailment of the body. Never in a god. A god believing himself mortal. I can only imagine. We're almost there. the serpent. Shaking. It's serious. We must hurry. Freya! Open the door! We need your help! Woman, do you hear me? It is urgent! I'm still a god! Go away! The boy has fallen ill! Freya! Inside. This is no ordinary illness. The boy's true nature, your true nature, fights within him. Uh. 
I did this to him. Will you help me? Of course. There is a rare ingredient found only in Helheim. The keeper that protects the Bridge of the Damned. I need its heart. Mm. Hell. The Realm of the Dead. Do you know it? Not this one. It is a land of unyielding gold. Fires cannot burn there, and no magic in all the Nine Realms can create a blaze. As for the dead, your frost axe will be useless. You'll need to find something else. Then I must return home. Dig up a past I swore would stay buried. Who you were before doesn't matter. This boy is not your past, he is your son. And he needs his father. This room opens the bridge to Helheim. When you are there, do not under any circumstances cross the Bridge of the Damned. There is no road back. Understand? Boy. Hey, Malay. You must hurry. Through my garden, there's a path leading to my boat. Take it. Return home. Dig up your past. Do whatever you need to do. Just bring me back the Bridge Keeper's heart. And your son may survive. Last we spoke, I was... No. You were right to distrust the word of a god. No need to explain. Not to me, not for that. I will keep him safe. That's a mother's promise. Oh.